So today we're doing vegetables all from the farmer's market here in Litchfield. And I brought a couple recipes that I did, which is uh, pickled zucchini spears, grilled vegetable ratatouille. And then while I was here, I came up with a couple new recipes. One is potato, kale, and tomatoes, which I just stewed. And then a cucumber salad with heirloom tomatoes, fresh mint, and basil. One tomato, one, uh, one uh, regular cucumber and two lemon cucumbers. With some, yeah. Yeah, a whole little one. <laughs> and I think I got a, I think I got one more little thing I'm gonna do with it. It's good. Never grilled potato before? Did you put any oil on it? Nope. Just cut it up and put it on. On the grill a little salt. Oops. And we have pickled zucchini. And then we have a cucumber salad with heirloom tomatoes and fresh mint. And then this is potatoes and kale. Oh, I gave him a bell. Are those going on um, steak sandwich. Steak sandwich. Yeah, we're making a peach barbecue sauce. Right? Why not? I got mint and, and basil. But yeah, I don't have any good. cilantro. Yeah. So I got to use whatever I have, you know. Yeah. Right. What are these samples? Oh, you can help yourself there. This is a grilled vegetable ratatouille. Mm, that looks pretty good. Yeah. Mm, and then we have this is kale and potatoes. That recipe I just came up with. The recipe for the ratatouille and the pickled zucchini is here. Mm -hmm. And then this is a cucumber salad I made with heirloom tomatoes. This lemon cucumber, uh, some fresh mint, and tomato and uh, basil. So we have a lot of things to try. And if you come back in a couple of minutes, we're having lunch. I'm making steak sandwiches. No, I'm kidding. Yeah, and the steak sandwich, we're going to do a peach barbecue sauce with it. And this is potatoes and kale. I do a column for the Hartford Current every Thursday. So this recipe and this recipe you'll see in the current in a couple weeks. And if the peach barbecue sauce comes out good, that'll be in there too. But we don't know yet. You're like me. You try it. Yeah, we got to give that a shot. We're not, we're not making any guarantees here. Yeah, I like your ratatouille. It's better than mine. So. The balsamic vinegar, that's what I'm tasting. Yep, right. yep. Yep, to the peach barbecue sauce, so we'll make it a little spicy. So this is a, a hot pepper. That's okay. And the peach barbecue sauce, I don't know. If you like it. I'm thinking. I yeah. think it's going to work. Yeah, I tried one this week. I'm going to try something a little different. I, yeah, you I had got some, it, right? Like some fairly wide patty pan squash. Yeah. I cut off the top of it and put some butter and parmesan oh, yeah. and a little onion and whatever. Yeah. And I think the next time I'm going to put in more butter. Yep. You know, like make a little dip in it so that more butter will stay. Butter makes it better. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. And no I think quite. roasted Everything. garlic, which I like didn't have the first time. soup or something, always put in some butter at the end. <laughs> <laughs> some, some cook told me that. I'm making lunch if you want to come back. Yeah, I'll be having steak sandwiches. Wow. Mm. This is our lunch from Laurel Ridge Farm. We have some steaks, and Bantam Bread gave us some bread, and I'm making a peach barbecue <laughs> sauce, and then we're gonna have steak sandwiches for lunch.